Kenny presents birthday. Yeah. Hello ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Exotic MTG 31 Days of Christmas Giveaway. Today is December 26th, Boxing Day known around the world, and also my birthday. So, um, hope you all had an amazing Christmas day. I want a big shout out to Exotic MTG for doing the video yesterday. Um, obviously today is my day and uh, we will be announcing the winner towards the end of the video. So without further ado, let's just jump straight into it. And as you see, these are the gifts that we are going to be giving away. So we have a Guilds of Ravnica sealed theme booster, a pack of Masters 25 and a pack of Return to Ravnica. So we're going to save the Masters for last and we'll do the Ravnica second and we'll open our sealed booster first. So. Um, as I said, hope you all had an amazing Christmas bit holiday, and uh, for those of you who don't celebrate, I hope you had a great day anywho. Right, so the sealed boosters are quite cool, I quite like these. Uh, you can obviously get a load of cards, you also get lots of things, Ooh, buy random bits and store barcodes and various things like that. Uh, there is a code for Arena as well, so you can get some free boosters, so please check that out. So let's see what you get in this deck. I do quite like the, I mean, maybe one thing I'll do like about these, literally you can pick it up, throw 35, throw in, uh, what is it, like 20 something lands I recommend, and you can just go to town. So yeah, get a couple of guild gates. So yeah, seems to be a big, yeah, convoke. Seems to be the probably the main thing in this. Oh, they have a few enchantment auras. Okay, that's interesting. Has the Island of Marshall, yeah, generate tokens, district guide. Wonder Vertebrae, Rosemane Centaur. Okay, we have Flower and Flourish. Join Sheets. Wary Ukapai. Uh, Centaur Peacemaker. Samara Woodsman, Shield Mate. The Guild Mage. Conclave Cavalier and the Rares. <gasps> wow, this is a great booster. This is a great themed one, wow. So you are getting, uh, the lucky winner is getting this Trostani Discordant, a five mana, essentially Lord uh, for all other creatures. It puts one plus one, but it is about to create two white, white, two one, one white soldier tokens with life link. So essentially you're getting, uh, what, five power spread across three bodies, not bad. And the beginning of each end step, play again, each player against control of all creatures that they own. Which is rather sweet. So essentially if you do have any blue effects, it's just stealing things away, you can get them back. So yeah, not bad. That is a great start for the uh, Boxing Day giveaway. So without further ado, we're going to crack open. I think we're going to go back to Ravnik first. So this is a set that I am uh, not not too familiar with, I'll be honest. So I don't know what the money cards are in here, but I know that there are some things probably that are worthwhile. We'll find out. Giant Gruff, great spell, especially against Infect. Oh, sorry, four in effect, I mean. Uh, Traitorous Instincts. Uh, four mana, gain control. It also boosts up the power of it. Root Born Defenses. Populate. Uh, populate is the mechanic where you first copy a token. Uh, it's what uh, the um, Selesny were using. So it actually could fit in quite nicely to a, a, a token jack. Creatures you control are indestructible this turn. Skull Rend deals two damage to each opponent. Those players each discard two cards at random. Five mana though, bit of, bit expensive. Hussar Patrol, so four mana, two, four, and Flash and Vigilance. Not too bad. Drudge Beetle, two mana, two, two, with Scavenge for six. So basically you exile the card from your graveyard and you, get, and you put a number of one, one counters equals to the card's power on target creature, and you can only scavenge as a sorcery. Oh, Fivel Fib, everyone's favourite doorkeeper. Lobba Crew, Goblin Warrior, 0 4, deals 1 damage, and whenever you cast a multi call spell, you get to untap it. It's a shame about the multi, the multi uh, call aspect, if it was ready, it'd be insane. 
mind rot, and this is the art I absolutely detest. Oh, I hate, you really don't like that. <laughs> it's just so disgusting. But two players, you know, discard two cards at random. Sorry, discard two cards, sorry. Then we have Solar of Songbirds. Uh, when there's a battlefield, put a 1 1 white bird creature, token on wood flying. Moving on to the uncommons, we have Civic Saber. One mana, creature gets plus one plus four for each of its colours, and you could put one, so a multi colour deck, very useful. Sliverhead. It's a 1 1 plant zombie with scavenge for zero. So, nice cheap way to boost up a creature for zero mana. Then we have New Prav Guild Mage. So, two mana, uh, tag a creature, it's a two mana, two two, tag a creature gets flying turn turn. Or five mana detain target non land permanent and for controls. It's basically detainees until your next turn that permanent can't attack or block and its activated abilities can't be activated. That was sweet. And the rare is Mizium Mortars. So two mana deals four damage to tag creature you don't control, or you can overload it for six and you'll deal four damage to each creature you don't control. So quite a decent board wipe, it's not too bad. And do we have anything else? No. And no. Got a nice mountain though, so definitely that's good. Right, so without further ado, on to our last booster. So, so far we've had a, a good uh, standard Lord and as well as Commander. And now we're moving on into uh, some spice. Hopefully we get something good. So, Oromancer, 3 mana, 2-2. Two, two. As a battlefield, you return target enchantment from Guerrero to hand. Also, can target enchantment creatures. Supernatural stamina. So, one mana, tag creature gets plus two plus one. When it dies, returns to the battlefield. Great. It was great during Hamlet Cat Block. Phantasmal Bear, when it comes to target spell ability, you have to sack it. But it's a one mana, two two. Plummet, great card. Uh, destroy target creature, we're fine. Phyrexian Ghoul. Sack a creature, gets plus two, plus two until the end of turn. So summon to an air talk ability. Ghost Ship, four mana, two, four with flying, and you can pay three blue to regenerate it. Dauntless Scathar, three mana, three, two. Uh, you can pay two mana, exile it from your graveyard and create one more white space. And you can only activate it at sorcery speed though. The Vessels of Nascency, one mana, sack it, look at the top five, you get an artifact creature in Shaman of the Land, or a Planeswalker. So essentially it's a one, you know, dig, dig spell turn two, it's quite good. Twisted Abomination, six mana, five, three, and you pay one mana to regenerate it, or you can pay two to Swamp Cycle. Chandra's Outrage, four mana, deals four damage to that creature and two damage to that creature's controller. Ishan's Shade, 6 mana 5-5 five, five pro white. Not too bad, it does have a knight subtype, so it's not too bad. It's first uncommon. Second uncommon is Treasure Keeper. So it's uh, 4 mana 3-3, three, three. when it dies, reveal, the top, reveal cards on the top of your library until you reveal a non-line card with CMC 3 or less. You may cast that card without paying its mana cost. Put all reveal cards, not cast this way, on the bottom of your library in a random order. And we have Caustic Tar, 6 mana Enchant Land. Enchant Land has tap, target player loses 3 life. And moving on to the rare, we have the Bident of Thassa. <laughs> 4 mana legendary enchantment artifact. So when it, whenever a creature you control deals combat damage to a player, you may draw a card and you can pay 2, tap, creatures your opponent's control attack this turn if able. It's great in Commander actually because you can actually force your opponents to attack when you don't want them to. And let's see, we get a foil, and the foil is Giant Grove! <laughs> Yay! We get foil common. This is the way we always work. Uh, so, one mana, creature gets plus three, plus three until the end of the turn. And we have a whale token. When this dies, create 9 9 blue kraken. So, um, that is it for our giveaway. So, we got a couple of foils. So we did get a couple of foils. But, you know, I suppose our, uh, the best one we did start off with is our uh, booster pack, which of course gave us um, the Trostani Discordant. So yeah, so what I want to say is congratulations to Tyler Sturgeon. You have won all this, my friend. Congratulations. And uh, yeah, just want to say, please make sure you check out uh, the link in the description box for the giveaway. It is still live until the end of the month. So there's still a few days left. 
and please 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 make sure you tune in to the dark side of magic's video tomorrow for his giveaway uh, links to both yesterday's video and tomorrow's video will be in the description box down below to their channels respectively and just want to say thank you for tuning in i've been your host jordan here from Ed, signing off goodbye